Dr. McLaughlin and I are going to talk about meningiomas. So meningiomas are typically benign tumors, almost always benign tumors, but the covering to the brain. They're not brain tumors. Um, they're tumors that arise from the dura, which is one of the harder, tougher coverings of the brain. There are three coverings of the brain, the dura, the arachnoid, and the pia. The pia is very tightly associated. Think about it as like shrink wrap on the brain. And then the subarachnoid space is kind of like a veil over it. And then the dura is like a leather sack around that. So the meningiomas grow from the, from the dura and they typically grow slowly and will cause compressive like symptoms. And uh, many times I'm called to see them and evaluate them for just, um, you know, uh, incidental finding. They found it on a, um, on a, on a scan for headaches or migraine, migraine symptoms or something. And there's nothing really to, to uh, worry about. We just uh, watch them and follow them with serial scans. So if, say somebody comes in with a new, newly diagnosed uh, meningioma and it's small, we'll usually just uh, we'll put them on a regular schedule to be screened, either six months to a year, depending on the size of it and what their age is. And then we'll watch them. Uh, if the scan is the same in six months to a year, then we'll oftentimes double that time period before we get another scan. And then ultimately, if it's stable for five, six years, you really don't need to follow it any longer.